Day one of a two-day visit to Italy in Libya's Colonel Gaddafi has already provoked outrage after trying to convert hundreds of Italian women to Islam. Some 700 young women drafted in by a hostess agency were invited to two separate events in Rome to listen to the Libyan leader's religious views. Each was reportedly paid 70 euros. While unconfirmed, three of the delegates are said to have undergone spontaneous conversions. The attempt to Islamize Italian women has led to an angry reaction in Italy's press. Many people on the streets of Rome were also displeased. This woman said it's not as though we take Gaddafi that seriously. He comes from a particular culture that treats women in this way. It's pathetic. As an Italian citizen, I'm indignant. Honestly, it's one thing to do business, but one's values are another thing. To change from one thing to another is just embarrassing. The Italian government should be very careful playing these dirty games. Much of the blame for Gaddafi's visit is being placed at the door of Premier Silvio Berlusconi, accused of sacrificing principles and dignity for the sake of trade. Since 2008, ties have flourished, with Italy becoming Libya's biggest trading partner after Rome and Tripoli signed a multi-billion colonial reparations deal.